It's absolutely pivotal. Uh, Teos Brussels, or to be more precise, bearing in mind the current circumstances, Teos Benelux has always been pivotal to the entire operation arrangements of the European Azerbaijan society. Uh, the reason why Brussels is important, there are a few things to consider. First of all, it's the capital of Belgium, small but very crucial European country. Uh, and also, the Brussels is the heart of the European Union. The, it's a very pivot of the European Union uh, institutional arrangements. So for those reasons, uh, Brussels has always been quite pivotal to, uh, to European Azerbaijan society. And also the number of Azerbaijans living in this part of Europe is increasing incrementally. And most of those people are students, some of them are professionals. And uh, it is quite clear that uh, there's a quite number of them will stay in Europe and will live here. So there will be uh, crucial ingredients of Azerbaijani diaspora in the European Union. So for that reason, uh, from the diaspora perspective, they are very important indeed to, uh, to European Azerbaijan society. Well, uh, the, the fundamental uh, problem uh, in terms of understanding the nature of the uh, Nagorno-Karabakh problem, which has been lasting for the last uh, uh, 22 years, uh, was the lack of uh, information. Uh, I think that uh, the Teos uh, Brussels, uh, Teos Benelux, uh, uh, has been absolutely pivotal in terms of increasing awareness of the nature of the conflict. Uh, and thanks to uh, this sort of uh, think tanks and organizations, this uh, awareness is increasing immensely. If we compare uh, what was the level of understanding for you uh, one decade ago and now the improvement is uh, quite uh, quite immense and quite conspicuous. Uh, so my uh, reflection is that uh, on, over the last two decades uh, the awareness of this conflict has increased immensely. Uh, what happened in April 2016 was a very important milestone. It did show only too clearly that this conflict is frozen but the uh, element of uh, active military confrontation is still there. So any time if the situation gets out of control, military conflict could be a part of the uh, possibility. So uh, after that conflict and also uh, the uh, increasing awareness of the, uh, the liberal and also negotiating stance of the Republic of Azerbaijan, I think that we may reach a certain point in the fullness of time when uh, the negotiation will be something which will lead to something very conclusive and uh, concrete.